Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a new gameplays on Game Boy TV. Great to be doing another walkthrough. Um, this is my sixth walkthrough on Game Boy TV. Um, the first walkthrough I did was New Super Mario Bros. 2 for the 3DS. Um, second gameplay was uh, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. That um, also was a couple years ago. I also did a partial walkthrough on Mario Tennis Open, and then um, obviously you, um, Tomodachi Life, which was probably the best walkthrough and also the longest walkthrough I've ever done. And then I did a little brief walkthrough of a uh, third party game called the Epic Word Search Collection, which, you know, just like, um, just like with Mario Tennis Open, I didn't get a chance to really come around and finish that. Um, so here, here we are, it's a new, this is a new game, just recently released, Mario & Luigi Paper Jam, which combines the elements of um, the Mario & Luigi series with the Paper Mario series. Finally, you know, a crossover of two um, really good RPG franchises in the Mario series. Um, so, I'm gonna explain just so briefly, um, the Paper Mario and the Mario and Luigi series, some of the similarities in it, and also some of the differences. So, the Paper Mario series started in 2000 for the Nintendo 64. Um, I don't have that game, but it's, uh, it was the first, it was the, it was, it was the game that was called, that was, uh, that was called to be the successor to, um, Super Mario RPG, um, and then it was the, the the title of the uh, of the game ended up being changed to Paper Mario, and you know the rest is history. So I have a before we begin, I do have a couple of games I do want to show you. Um, I do have Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door for the Nintendo GameCube, as well as uh, Super Mario, Super Paper Mario, which. Um, I know a lot of people don't like that game. I personally liked it for how different it was um, in the series, um, and also for its emotional storyline, and probably one of the darkest storylines in in the Mario franchise. As far as um, as far as the Mario and Luigi series goes, I have Superstar Saga, which I've beaten a couple times already for the uh, Game Boy Advance. And that that really takes me back. A long, long time ago. Um, Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. I can't believe that game is already 10 years old. And um, I have it. I have the box still saved. I also beat that game. Um, a friend of mine gave me this as a present. Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story. And um, Mario and Luigi Dream Team. So, yeah, the Mario and Luigi series... And the Paper Mario series are both wonderful franchises, and both of them share a very deep, uh, long, and winding, unique storyline. Um, both series uses partners to help aid Mario. Um, both series also uses badges or special equipment to modify stats, and they also use turn-based um, battle combat uh, system with nearly identical options to choose from whenever you engage in a battle. And both games make use of humor and clever gimmicks to keep the game uh, the gamer refreshed throughout the, the long game. You know, RPGs are not short games. They take a lot of time. Um, so those are just some of the similar um, features that each of these uh, series has. There's a bunch of differences as well. Um, you know, and Mario and Luigi, the Mario and Luigi and the Paper Mario series um, definitely have a lot of differences between them, such as in the Paper Mario series, um, the game is divided into chapters, whereas in the Mario and Luigi series, the game is continuous. In the Paper Mario series, you have multiple allies as partners that you can change anytime. But in the Mario and Luigi series, Luigi is your only partner. Now, of course, there's variations throughout each game, you know, that is unique to its own. 
Um, in the Mario and Luigi series, after battle, you gain experience points. In Paper Mario, you get star points. And there's also star power in the Paper Mario series, which can be used to provide extra damage to an enemy that is not featured. And that, that's not featured in the Mario and Luigi series. Um, so, also, that, also absent from the Mario and Luigi series is the Pit of 100 Trials that is totally exclusive to the Paper Mario series. And I think the most obvious difference is that Paper Mario is in 2D and Mario & Luigi is in 3D. Um, with with um, Super Paper Mario being the only exception, and that was like a platformer game uh, with a little bit of the Paper Mario element in it. Um, also, in the Mario & Luigi series, the camera views seem to be more like from a top, you know, from like top to bottom, like you know, you're looking down at Mario and Luigi, where, um, you know, in in the Paper Mario series, the camera is more fixated, you know, on near the ground, um, and you know, so kind of providing a more dynamic view of Mario. So, um, I think this is going to be a unique game. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a lot of references to a lot of other games in the Mario. Uh, in the Mario series in general, um, I'm, I'm kind of excited to do this game, and I really want to start this game now, and I'm pretty curious. So, okay, so here we're going to start a new game, I pick red. Um, I'm interested to see how they combine both, um, both elements from both series, you know, are we going to see, are we going to see badges again, or is there going to be something totally new? So, I'm eager to find out. And please excuse that, you know, that dot, that little black spot in the middle of the screen. I Something is wrong with my camera. I can't really figure it out, so I don't want this to detract from anything. But let's see what the story is, uh, is all about. So, pressing R. I wonder what pressing R does. Oh! It fast forwards the story. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, so we're in Peach's castle right now. And I think we see Toad. Yeah, that's Toad. You feel that draft? There's a hole somewhere in the wall and it's letting in cold air. Brr. Hmm. Is it coming from over here? Oh, it sounds like Luigi. <laughs> Don't be scared, Luigi. <laughs> What's that? You're scared of the dark? Hmm, I see what you mean. It's a little creepy in here. I opened the curtains. All better? Okay. Alright then. Where is that draft coming from? Aha! There it is! There's like a, there's a hole there. It's pretty high up and my legs are pretty short. I don't think I can reach it by myself. Okay, pressing B makes Luigi jump. Oh, you'll go check it out? Thanks, Luigi. Okay, so we could move around. Alright. Using the circle pad uh, controls Luigi. Sorry. My camera will my camera will do this intermittently. It'll lose focus. Oh, there's a rat there's a rat there. What's that? A mouse? I must have missed it. Oh, so, okay, it's a mouse, not a rat. Anyway, you're not scared of a little mouse, are you? Please finish checking the hole in the wall. Huh. Will do. 
Um, stop messing around. Can you please see if that's where the draft is coming from? Okay. Yeah. Wow. Uh-oh. <laughs> Toad's being chased around by that mouse. Someone give that mouse a piece of cheese. Um, Luigi. You know it's right behind you, right? Oh, so much dust. I see where this is going. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Uh oh. Snap out of it, Luigi. That book is doing something weird. Oh no! So this is where we all start, eh? This wouldn't have been a bad time to hire Harry Potter. Maybe get every one of those characters back in that book. But now I guess it's raining paper. All right, Goombas, fall in. Huh? I guess we got a bunch of new recruits. Where am I? Says another toad. Hey! You're flatter than a flapjack! You guys are rounder than s that snowman! Okay. Show us that move again. Welcome to Team Bowser, new recruits. With that attack, you'll chew right through Mario. I... I can't believe what I'm seeing. Oh my gosh! No way! What seems to be the matter? Princess? No. Oh my goodness! Wow, so... The Paper Mario World and the, and the real Mushroom Kingdom are separate. <laughs> so it's like the Paper Mario World is like an alternate dimension. Luigi! Do you have any idea what's going on? No, of course you don't. Are you? <laughs> oh my. Am I seeing double? I may faint. Oh, so you do know what's going on, Luigi. Mm-hmm. So you were fixing a hole in the wall? When that book fell down? You were shocked and likely quacking in your boots? 
And then you started dancing. Wait, why were you dancing? Um, hmm. Uh, Luigi? Is this explanation gonna take much longer? Let's see what the princesses have to say about all this, Mario. Use the circle pad to walk over to them. Alright, so... Pretty much... I would say everything that has happened in the Paper Mario series all happened in that book that was hidden up in the attic of Peach's castle in the real Mushroom Kingdom. So let's go talk to, to the princesses. I can't believe there's a whole other dimension. And another me, says Peach. Yes, I'm just as shocked. Opening that book sent us all flying out of our world and into this one. I believe the way back home for us is through that book. It's all bewildering. There, there, you paper highness. We'll take good care of you. I'm Starlo, so now... Starlo introduces herself to Paper Peach. I'm a representative of the Star Spirits and de facto guide for Mario and Luigi. Pleased to meet you. Alright, so we got Starlo back in this game. While we figure out how to get you home, why don't you do some sightseeing? I'm sure Mario and Luigi would be more than happy to give you a tour of the kingdom. That's a lovely idea, says the real Peach. Despite the circumstances that brought us together, I'm very pleased to meet you. <laughs> and talking to myself like this is a real hoot. Yes, it's quite a pleasure to meet you too, Mario. <laughs> Mario, you never speak so formally with me. I think someone's feeling a little shy. Come on now, don't just stand there all googly-eyed. <laughs> nice to meet you, Luigi. Uh-oh. <laughs> You're blushing, Luigi. Uh-oh. Peach! Yes? Uh, who are you? Ah, there you are, Princess Peach. A flurry of toads have suddenly appeared. They look at a, like us, but flattened. That's what I just said, Luigi. Anyway, I've never seen such a scared bunch. They're shaking like leaves on a tree. Of course, of course the toads are frightened, given what they've just experienced. Please gather them so that we can welcome them properly. I can try if I can get them to stop freaking out long enough to listen to me. Good idea, Mario. You might have an easier time taking them down. Talking them down. Okay, so we've got an extra, we've got our a mission to do. Wait, before you go, take this with you. Oh, a guide, the guide. Open it from the menu to learn about all kinds of stuff. The menu is your gateway to all kinds of helpful info. To open it, press start or tap menu on the bottom screen. Alright, so let's do a little bit of exploring. And uh, walking around, so we've got a coin. I like to take my time with this, you know, I like to look at every nook and cranny, because this is what RPGs are all about, you know, it's just like taking your time to relax, and, you know, one thing can't, can't happen, you know, un until you get to the mission, so you can explore around all you want, maybe accidentally find a side quest, so before we head to our next screen, this is what the bottom of the screen looks like, we've got our save option, so we can save on this new game, under this new game spot. 
Ooh, here's something new that that we're, we already have. We've got the hammer option. Before, in other Mario & Luigi games, you had to progress through a little part of the game to earn the hammer, but I believe only Mario has the hammer so far. And then on here, we've got our menu. And in our menu, we've got the stats and also how long we've been playing the game so far. We've got 102 coins. Luigi has more HP than Mario, but both are at 100% of health. Well, this has an amiibo feature, but because my 3DS does not support amiibo, unfortunately, we will not cover this part of the game. I, we, I really wish I could, but, you know, um, my 3DS is from 2011, so. Okay, so we've got no special effects. We've got boots. We've got a rundown hammer. A dirt cheap wear. So pretty much basic items so far, not too much. Uh, you know, looking at Luigi. These are all of his stats. Um, also, we, got, we could look at all of our items. We've got six mushrooms, which store restore 30 HP as well as a one-up mushroom. We've got no beans. You know, at the bottom here, we've got beans. We've got syrup. Oh, we've got a couple of syrup jars now. Three syrup jars, to be exact. No beans and no refreshing herbs. And our collection. Okay, so we've got... Hmm. I guess these are special kinds of blocks. I'll, I, I'll, we'll see what this is all about later on. Paper Toads. Okay, so we have to also rescue Paper Toads in this game, as you saw. And, you know, that's exactly what the mission is that, that was explained a moment ago. And our status. These are all the statuses that we have. And also, we've got our guide. You can learn about different attacks and battle strategies if we click on battle. Hmm, maybe we could save this for another time. You know, just for, for to show you the kinks of the game and also for me to understand. So why don't we just, why don't we stop it right here? That was a great introduction. And then we'll explain a little bit more in our next episode. So we're gonna save this game. Thanks for watching. Gameplays on Game Boy TV, ladies and gentlemen. I think this will be an exciting walkthrough.